good morning to all today we're going to discuss about the slide history of biotechnology the technology that uses living organisms to produce and improve a desired products with the help of plants and animals you get a lot of products that products is with the help products is known as biotechnology biotechnology is nowadays the application of scientific and engineering principles to the processing of materials by biological agents and it provides a good science services the term biotechnology was coined by Carl Erke so various innovations have several practical applications in environmental production and production of natural resources like forest and everything earth and forest and in welfare of domestic plants animals and also human beings the next slides shows the history of biotechnology the history of biotechnology shows the traditional biotechnology as well as modern biotechnology the traditional biotechnology has been so used for thousands of years to produce a food that and also a health care products today modern biotechnology enables to use to develop a improved products so all the improved products are safely and the biotechnology is one form of another as low is a free historic times during the 3000 bc to 2000 bc old people used to make bread fermentation of fruit juices and plant extracts are to produce an alcoholic beverages various alcoholic beverages with the help of yeast the next slide shows the evolution of free 20th century of biotechnology 1770 lavoisier gave a basis for alcoholic fermentation how the alcohol is process fermentation process takes place with the help of chemical process 1798 edward jenner first viral vaccine to inoculate a child from smallpox in 1838 protein discovered by gerardus jogonus and Jones Jocker in 1871 Ernest Copier Sailor discovered enzyme invertase the yeast having enzyme two enzymes invertase and cymase this invertase enzyme which is used for making artificial sweeteners in 1876 1876 Louis Pasteur identified various microorganisms involved in fermentation the next slide shows the history of 20th century of biotechnology in 1919 the time biotechnology was coined by carl erke 1928 discovery of penicillin by alexander fleming the sources of penicillin are penicillium notatum is now it is called as a wonder drug so this is a very good antibiotic then in 1953 discovery of double helix structure of dna so structure of dna double helix model watson and crick in 1972 the discovery of restriction enzymes the restriction enzymes are endonuclease then exonuclease and ligase for various genetic engineering tools discovered by arbor and smith and nathans in 1975 the production of monoclonal antibodies by kochler and milstein the next slide says after that continued 20th century in 1970 production of human insulin the insulin from e coli in 1979 development of artificial gene they are discovered by hg corona 
use of TA plasmids to genetically transformation plants. So genetically modified TA plasmids are very important for tumor induced plasmids. The tumor induced plasmids caused by Agrobacterium timibiciens. These timibiciens are very important for genetically modified plants or transgenic plants. In 1986, a development of polymerase chain reaction that is PCR, otherwise called a thermocycler. This thermocycler are discovered by Cray and Mullis. Nowadays, the coronavirus detection by PCR method. Then the, during the 2000, first plant growth of Arabidis thaliana is sequenced, DNA genome, the first isolated plant genome that from Arabidis thaliana. The next slides shows during the 20th century history of biotechnology, 2001 human genome project creates by the genome sequence. In 2002, plant crop like plant genome introduced in the common paddy plant Orisa sativa. In 2010, Robert Edwards developed a in vitro fertilization method in animals. During the 2016, stem cells are injected to stroke patients during with the help of stem cell therapy. During the 2017, blood stem cell grown in a lab. So in this we detail study about the traditional biotechnology. The traditional biotechnology is a kitchen technology. This technology followed by our ancestors. The technology, what are the use, uses a lot of bacteria and microbes. They are used in yeah, preparation of our daily products, dairy, daily products like uh, gourd, ghee and cheese. In the preparation of foods like Italy and Tosa are uh, traditionally method of biotechnology. The preparation of alcoholic beverages like beer and wine are prepared from traditionally. This, this type of kitchen technologies are nowadays very scientific validation properties. The next slide shows modern biotechnology. The modern biotechnology is very important nowadays. The ability to change the genetic material and get a new products. The, all the new products are with the requirement through a rDNA technology. That is recombinant DNA technology. So the recombinant DNA technology we get a lot of um, uh, various uh, various engineering, genetic engineering as well as recon technology we get a lot of uh, new products. The next one, the modern biotechnology, the ownership of newly developed technology and its social impact. Today, biotechnology is a more benefit around the world in the field of pharmaceutical companies breweries and agro-industries. Finally, the modern biotechnology are these methods of genetic modification by cell fusion technology and recombinant DNA technology. So the next slides shows the focus of biotechnology. The various biotechnology that biotechnology are, are used for various biotechnology field. They are so major focus of biotechnology are fermentation, then bio mass enzymes, biofuels, microbial inoculants, RDN technology, and various process of engineering. So, uh, fermentation for production of acids, enzymes alcohols, antibodies, chemicals, vitamins and toxins. So from the fermentation method, 
we get these products and the second one is biomass so biomass is a bulk production of a single we get a lot of cells from isolated from a single cell protein from a blue green algae like chlorella and algal and they are used as a biofuel so it is a, you get more energy from the biofuel so another one is enzymes enzymes are biocatalysts but these enzymes are used as a sensor biosensors in processing industry biofuels are get from production of hydrogen algal and methane so all these are biofuel then another last one is microfluidic inoculants that is biofertilizer and nitrogen fixers so biofertilizers we get various biofertilizers chemical manures and nitrogen fixers and another one slide shows the plant and animal cells are production of secondary metabolites like alkaloids terpenoids and everything and also produce monoclonal antibodies so with the help of rna technology the production of chemicals enzymes vaccines growth hormones antibiotics and interferons the interferons are protein based protein based drug so from this rna technology a lot of um, uh, interferons are produced the engineering during the engineering method genetic engineering method so the process of genetic is the biotechnologies are very important tools for effluent treatment from yes, a discharge of various waste and uh, waste materials then all the effluent waste are from factories industries all these are recycling and also drainage water that is the drainage water should be recycling methods that is a commonly they are called environmental biotechnology so in modern biotechnology different types of valuable products are produced with the help of microbiology division biochemistry tissue culture genetic engineering molecular biology and immunology okay thank you the most